All right, welcome. I'm going to show you how to share your screen in Discord. It is super easy. So first you're going to click on a voice channel. You know it's a voice channel because it makes that sound. And it also will have a speaker right next to it. Also, it lights up when you're speaking, okay? So that's how you know. Now, if you want to share your video, you turn on the camera and then people can see you there, okay? Now, if you want to share your screen, you have to click on this share your screen button. Bottom left, super easy, like I said. Now, it's going to offer to share an application. That's fine if you want to share the sound of an application, but here, instead of an application, I'm going to share the entire screen. This is really gonna help your instructor even a little bit more. So, I have multiple monitors. If you have multiple monitors, you're going to see several screens. A lot of you will just have one screen. So you're gonna select the screen that you're on. So it's probably gonna be screen one. Now I'm gonna share screen two and go live. Okay, so now in if I had a lot more people in this class, you'd have a bunch of people on the sides here all over. And now I can click over to this and you can see that this is my screen. And now the instructor can tell me, oh, hey, I really like your code. I think it's really good. So that is a quick tutorial about how to share your screen. And your screen should be shared for all of the time that we spend working on projects, you know, whatever it is, whether it's Scratch or Minecraft or Roblox or Python or, or whatever, what have you. Now, if you wanna ever sh stop sharing, you don't click disconnect because that will, you won't be able to hear anyone. You click stop streaming. So you click stop streaming. It goes away. And if you want to turn off your camera, you click turn off camera. And then people could still hear you and you can still hear them. But it doesn't, um, you don't, you don't have to share your video or your screen anymore. So that is just a quick tutorial about how to do those things. If you do have any questions, feel free to talk to your instructor directly um, via phone or via Discord or shoot an email to james at coderkids.com. Thank you so much. Bye.